The management of state-owned Petrotrin say they are trying their best to engage and involve the various trade unions connected to the company before making any major moves in the future. Speaking at a recent Joint Select Committee meeting, Petrotrin Chairman Wilfred Espiné said while it is not easy in the spirit of goodwill, they are trying to ensure transparency moving forward. He said the company is well aware of the current economic circumstances in the oil and gas field internationally and how it affects this country directly, so it is not expecting a golden parachute from the government. Looked intelligently at the present status of Trinidad and Tobago and the finances of the government of Trinidad and Tobago, where we have been reducing our services in a number of areas and, and um, the support system has been shrinking and where there are daily um, you know, um, statements being made about various people who are being delayed in their payment systems, etc. Our position as a board has been that there is no way that we could expect to get support from the government. Well, I mean, fine, meaning a checkbook support. Well, uh, well, uh, be, meaning financial support. Right, correct. And really, if viability is a possibility, then that is what we should be heading to.